Hi guys, it's just amazing what you can get for a couple of pounds nowadays. I bought these Bluetooth headphones from eBay for about 2.8 pounds maybe, something like that. These are PS19. These have a mini USB port for charging the battery. Teeny tiny on-off switch and well-positioned power LED, which is in the inside, pointing to your neck when wearing these, so it won't light up the whole surrounding when you are wearing these. There's also three buttons for controlling the playback. They are next, play, pause and previous, which can control for example music player on your phone. There's also labeled TF, which is another name for a micro SD card, but this one doesn't have the slot, so no MP3 playback on this model. The main material is this soft plastic. Because the shape is like a square tube, these won't bend too much, but these can be twisted like this. So on the other hand, these will keep their shape quite well, but also these will adapt to different shaped heads. I'm not saying these are the most comfortable headphones, but I was quite surprised considering these are 3 pound headphones made out of cheap plastic. If for some reason you want to replace the wires going from the main unit to the earpieces, you can make the wires visible by removing this rubber band. There's not much there, so we'll move on to the main unit. There's this rubber flap that can be removed. Then there are four screws that can be opened. The reason why I bought these headphones was that I was going to remove the original earpieces and maybe integrate these into full-sized headphones because if you remove the earphones from this, this is quite nice small unit with battery, Bluetooth receiver, buttons, everything in this small plastic case which can be easily integrated into for example headband of the headphones. But I'm not sure if I'm going to do that, because these are pretty good. Sound is okay for listening podcasts, watching YouTube, etc. There's not much bass, but otherwise the sound is good, or at least good enough for me. Okay, the case is open, and we can see the battery, and this funny looking Bluetooth antenna. It looks like it is on the both sides of the PCB, with wires going on every corner. That's something I haven't seen, at least not many times. There's nothing interesting under the battery and no markings on the battery. On the other side of the PCB is where the magic happens. Like some of you might have guessed, this is basically one chip solution. And look at that, there's the micro SD card slot or place for it. And another chip, which could be battery charger or monitor. It is labeled LTHG, maybe. I'm not sure what that is. The main I see, it may be hard to see the text on it, but that looks like a Bacon logo. And the model number is BK3254. I have seen that number before. I'm not sure if this is programmable, but if it is, considering this is made by Bacon, you won't find any information about programming it online. I'm almost sure about that. I still haven't decided if I'm going to use these as is, or if I'm going to use these to modify regular headphones into Bluetooth headphones. Either way, I'm quite happy with my purchase. If you want to buy one of these and give them a try, either as a headphones or as a module used for your own projects, I'll put the link in the description to eBay search results of similar headphones. It would be highly appreciated if you could like this video, subscribe if you haven't already, and maybe leave a comment if you know anything about programming bacon, Bluetooth modules or chips. See you in next video. Thanks. Bye.